Hey all Steve here from Stan Station Japan. It's the end of the day. Ridiculous turnout. It's gonna be like a four-hour video, so I'm gonna chop this up. This is gonna be all the Honda Civics, because there was a crazy turnout of good Hondas here. I wanna spend a little more time on them. So all the Honda stuff, let's get in there in this video. Look at that turnout. Holy cow, and it keeps going over there in the distance. Okay, this is insane. Just everything. Let's do some Hondas real quick. Yeah. S1s. Some Veramundi wheels. Yeah, that's cool. Some Chevrons. And some there, CR1s. Boom. Oh, with the NSX. What are the rebuilt OEM wheels? I don't know, they got Honda center caps. What are these things? Is this like a Chamaro Boy rebuild there? Yeah, look at this pair. Almost my garage. Another lovely EG. Carbon front lip. Maybe exceed. Cage. The TEs, good spec. Some more BBS goodness on the CRX. Wow. Fit it. Paint is mint. Camber is dialed. Holy cow. Sick. Need some Type R headlights on there. So we got a sticker bomb, Miyoko crossbar, interior on this. Let me get far enough back so we can see it. Look at this guy. Good looking EK. Chevlon Racing front mesh with like rainbow neochrome bolts on the hardware. And then I love the pin on the center caps. Fancy S2K. You gotta love it. Heck yeah, FK8 on some Regos. I love that they remade Regos. That needed to happen. I wish Ganadors would actually come out and make real Ganadors instead of all these knockoffs going around. Definitely a market for the good stuff. And that's a really cool blue. Did the Integra pull off a blue like that? And sit there behind the car, she's the owner, and she said, yeah, these are the new model Regas. Just crazy, like this is not stance at all. Look how high it is, but it's so freaking cool. <laughs> Got a nice little old Honda Odyssey. A crowd gathering around. That's weird for a Honda Odyssey. Nice equips on it. What's going on up here? What is this? A J30? J, I'm not sure on the number code, but definitely an engine swap. I'm guessing. I don't know it at all, but that's crazy. Big old V6 stuffed in there. All right, here's a skyline for you guys. Just kidding, look at this Integra. Woo. This front end was here, but it was, uh, what, like the earlier models, I think, like DC1 of the early generation. Totally shaved. Jay's Racing Muffler, maybe. TEs. Okay, okay. I think the Integra could be here. Should've brought my DC2. Not that far off. A couple notables here. A, you just don't see these anymore. I don't even know the chassis code on these early Civics. EF? EF four-door? Yeah, I think so. There's your parts, guys. Been hit, hit up with a lot of those requests recently. Yes, another EG. We got a nice little B16B in there. Header, Skunk 2 Ultra Manny on it. Gutted, stripped out. Race car spec. Chronicles sticker, exceed lip. VTech Club. Here's what, spoon mirrors? Jeez, here's like a period look, minus the aggressive flares and the uh, wheel fitment, camera and stuff, but like, what is that, the C West front bumper? CRX? Yeah, so good. Body is ridiculous on this. Interior also painted. It's cool to see CRX is still bouncing around. 
I'm getting attention. Look at that interior. Boom, <laughs> another stock body car. Beautiful EG, look at that thing. This thing brings back memories. My brother and I flipped one of these years and years ago. It's had a little bit of rust that he fixed up and then we sold it, made some money. I mean, we're talking like it's almost 20 years ago at this point, that's insane. All right, got a nice little S2K lineup here. T37 spoon brakes, hard top. Another T37, and what, Takata Green? Or it looked like Takata Green. Porsche brakes? What is that brake conversion there? Very proper. More TE37s, new spec. Really neat blue on there. Worked well with the bronze. Nice Subaru. Let's keep the S2Ks going in a very different variety. Thanks to that couple for the dramatic reveal. Look at that. Mega Stance spec over here, followed by Mega Stance spec 2. We got like the Daily Driver track spec over there with TEs. Stancy Camber life over here. Pardon the interruption and advertisement, but nerdgold.jp for all your parts, sourcing, and buying needs from Japan. Send me the link and I'll send you an estimate and we'll get some of the stuff headed your way in the future. Pretty sure this is 396 motoring, but yo, check it out from the last video. Honda Verno right there. NSX's came from Honda Verno dealerships. Thanks, Lobo Zach. These are all Brick Squad, it says. Nice EK. Followed by nice EG, but did we not just see this car? Similar look and spec, just more aggressive wheels on it than the other TEs. Shout out for the Shout out for the team name. Brick Squad. Super good turnout of EGs here. I'm not complaining. I don't know for Civic if I lean towards EG or EK. Definitely love the hatches. Both of them are very cool. Sick NSX. All by sick. Pan speed maybe? Yellow? FD, that's awesome. What a pair. 1552 wheels on this super clean and like neon electric blue EK hatch. That's cool. Curiously, maybe it's a stance car or like a show car thing, not like Type R headlights on a lot of these. They're all maybe clear USDM style or just clear OEM style. I don't know. This is interesting. It says veil sight in the front bumper, but the rear overfender looks a lot like a GTA 6 Panda grafted onto an S2K. All right, we'll wrap it up there. Thanks for watching. See you in the next one. Don't forget to check out the channel. There's going to be an S chassis in one of these videos, and there's also going to be a, just a general recap of just whatever else in it, because it's just crazy, crazy turnout. So check those out on the channel. We'll see you in the next one. Much love. Be well.